They've had four qualifying spots. We had uh, Mago taking the first one, Higuchi taking the second one, Daigo mm -hmm. Umahara with the third one, and now Kawano joins here in the fourth one. And I can only imagine, you know, uh, just the elation that Kawano was feeling and such. And, you know, I, I do believe we're going to try to get him onto an interview here. We'll let you know mm -hmm. if we get a chance. Actually, I think we're ready to go. <laughs> so uh, Perfect. let's see if we can get Kawano on. Ah, there we go. Kawano-san. Yes. Hello. Hello to Kawano-san. <laughs> and uh, uh, obviously, you know, one of the first questions that I want to ask is after he won, you know, what was his reaction? Did he, did, was it very emotional for him or did he jump up and cheer? Did he <laughs> cry? I, I just want to know how he felt after he won. あの、今回こういう風にあの優勝なさいまして、あの感情的にはどうでしたでしょうか。泣いたりとか叫んだりとか、あ、そういう風なリアクションはありましたか。うん、泣いたり叫んだりはなかったですけど、多分今までの大会
a really bad situation. Right. So I tried to switch okay. this time. I like that. Yeah, he was really maintaining his, his mental mm -hmm. state in terms of like mm -hmm. how he was performing. So that is a pretty, pretty big signifier. So really big ups to him for yeah. making those adaptations. Yeah. Yeah, the last question that I have here is, I mean, obviously there's this storyline in Japan about the veterans, the, you know, the old players versus the young players here. Now, obviously, uh, there's no question about that Kawano is clearly one of the best of the young players. So what's what kind of advice would he give to the other young players out there to get to the level that he has achieved and to be able to break through and defeat some of the classic warriors uh, from the fighting game community in Japan. え、現在ですね、え、日本に行きましては、ベテラン勢とそれからあの、若い、え、新しい世代という風が、あ、戦っていると思うんですけれども、岡松、川野さんのように、え、若い子いった世代、え、こういった、あ、人たちがこれから台